Yeah, buddy, we have arrived. 2,100 miles later, we're here in the town of Clearwater. This is where Matt's Clearwater Kayak Festival happens. Can't wait, man. the takeout of the Clearwater River. I'm gonna roll up stream and camp out with some other kayakers tonight and tomorrow the festival begins. We're gonna stay here right here. It's our camping spot. We're at camp. Matt's over here about to hang signs for the festival. Yeah, so we're gonna roll up the road and hang up uh, some signs for the festival so people know where to go what to do. Mac and cheese is in the oven. I got 35 minutes to be back here or else it's burning. This is Matt. It's the dude that puts it on. What's your pup's name? Sitka. Sitka. Yeah, so what's this river called, Matt? It's the Clearwater River, Timmy. The Clearwater River. Clearwater River. Here goes Matt slaving away. What you got there, buddy? Do not block the road, huh? Parking. How many people were you expecting oh, for the fest? Like probably 100? about 100 registered paddlers, I'm thinking, then another 50, 60 boyfriends, girlfriends, non-paddlers. That's a lot of humans. And then another probably 150 people who come just for the party. And yeah. Hang out. It's a race. And also, with the, ironically enough, the beginner put it oh, nice. for kayakers. Yeah, so these guys are basically putting signs up before the festival begins tomorrow so people actually know where to go during the races up here. So Clearwater River is right down here in this valley. You can hear it down there. Instead of using string, I just used this for, oh, I didn't even bring That's what I did this year. I like threw down and got like aluminum signs, like DOT style. And it's like, that for parking, year. makes a huge difference. So Matt's been putting this festival on since 2007, 2008. So basically exactly as long as the Six Mile Creek uh, Whitewater and Bluegrass Festival that I threw, like 15 odd years. Check out that ski pole. Bam. I'm not that good of a boater, I'll never run it. Okay. You, you head right? Well, I've, seen it, I've seen it run a hundred times. Okay. Yeah. Not for me though. There's the road where it used to be. Oh yeah. The road is washed away. Yeah buddy, get some mac and cheese. Bitches mac and cheese in the oven. Uh, I'm gonna eat some dinner, chill out, and the festival begins tomorrow. Good morning everybody. It's Friday morning. It's the day of the festival. The day it begins. We're gonna go do a lap because I've never paddled this river. Get the crew camping down here. Getting ready for a clear water lap. Should be good. It's pretty high, isn't it? Medium high. Medium high. Okay. There you go. There you have it. I'm pretty stoked. This is my first run on, hold on, I'm gonna kill a mosquito. Uh, this is my first run on Clearwater River. So I wanna go down it and check out the lines so I know where to race, know where to go, know how not to get worked. Let's go boating. So this is the takeout of the Clearwater River. Parked our vehicles here. We're gonna head upstream with the kayaks and go send it. Let's go check it out. Little van life going on over here. What's up, folks? Yeah. <laughs> Got two people shaving outside to put in now. You've seen it here. We are here at the put-in. Kettle Falls uh, Trail is right there. Down we go. So as you guys can see, there's the put-in parking lot. Cross through this little ditch here. And here is the Kettle Trail. So we're gonna walk down here. This takes us to the base of Kettle Rapid, which is pretty gnarly. And uh, we'll float on down to the bridge. I've never done this. I'm not gonna say I'm nervous, but uh, my senses are heightened. All the stuff you're about to see is going to be in the race. That's what everyone's racing tomorrow. So I wanna get out here, pick out my lines ahead of time. So I actually know where to go. Holy, that's very large rapid. <laughs> There's about 15,000 CFS out here right now, so it's big water. So what, you get a ferry, you just put it in here or something? People don't start in that eddy right there. Some people do, yeah. but it's pretty fun. Yeah. That is, uh, that's big water. This is the biggest bit, though. This yeah. Is, you know, this is <laughs> All right, so we're gonna put in in this recirculating sketchy eddy and uh, ferry out in front of this big boulder. 
and downstream we go. So it's the rapid like right around the corner, we just drop right yeah. into it. Yeah, so there's a couple of big eddies you can pass, and then there's two fingers. So there's a finger on the left, finger on the middle, finger on the right. You got scouting when you get down to it or are you just going? Um, I think we're just start going. Whew, this is a big river, boys and girls. So that's Kettle Falls. That is absolutely massive. I'm sure this GoPro is doing zero justice. morning <laughs> all my shoulders get warmed up all right Woo. oh it's big water <laughs> this looks small but it's so powerful If you get slower than the water, the whirlpools will start getting you too. It's just, I don't know what it is, it's intimidating to me. Because you're not completely in control. Which you never are in life, but I definitely like little creeks where you don't have so much volume shoving you around. like the high side of low like pretty much medium water hard to believe That's a nice wave, man. Good call. So yeah, that's super smooth. Wow, look how high the water gets up there. Logs like 10 feet up in the air. Here's the takeout bridge. Taken out here. Nice run, boys. Awesome. Drag your boat downhill to the water. Walk 60 feet to the truck at the end. Not bad. Yes, sir. So I'm gonna go roll up to the Clearwater Ski Resort and uh, see if Matt needs any help getting set up for the festival. And uh, it starts in a couple hours, so let's do it. We are rolling down the hill towards this Clearwater Ski Resort hill, whatever, it's up there, you can see it, see all the grass in the mountain. Here we are at the resort. Look at that pair of shoes up in the power line. <laughs> I haven't seen that in a long time. Let's find a camping spot. That sign of people up in here. Early registration. So this is the Clearwater Ski Hill Lodge. This is where the after party is gonna be inside. And he's doing our registration sign up, donation, chili and beer, all that good stuff. Yeah, no lining up. You can't line up. Take my money. I'm serious, you can stand around, you can get chili by donation, but lineups make me feel like we're at a church or like in a bank or something. What's wrong with the church, man? 
That was a bad reference. <laughs> Alright, thanks, man. Grab yourself an arm link. Alright. So... My arms are pretty stubby. So are mine. How's that? Oh, man. Here, let me help you out. You're not very good at this. Yeah. Right? My arm, you gotta have a longer arm than... There you, you go. Two arms? Why do slack? There you go. That's a wingspan. Yeah, it's better than yours, eh? Yeah. Sometimes it's good to let me do it. <laughs> yes, our registration is 8 a.m. tomorrow, and then the races start at 10. Look what just showed up. First other truck test I've ever seen in person. <laughs> These guys uh, found out I was passing through and drove out to the festival to meet up really quick. It's a crash in here. Pretty sweet. Get him to do a tour. Get that hip roof set up. Did a great job building it. Milled a lot of his own wood too, which is pretty cool. And they've got a uh, the family of four in there. So this one, if you notice, it's a lot wider than the truck. So it doesn't look like it'd be a lot wider inside, but there's a ton more room inside because it sticks out a little bit more. You can see how this one doesn't stick out at all. It's kind of in line with the truck. Pretty wicked. Matt's still awake right now. Still signing people up hours later. Yeah. No, I moved them already. Six hours later, still going. <laughs> she went the back. you guys in the morning. Good morning everybody. It's Saturday morning of the Clearwater Kayak Festival. Getting stoked. Got a fresh cup of joe going down here. A little Jimmy Dean sausage biscuit in the oven. Getting our day started. 
Make all the gears dried out. Looks pretty good. Uh, I believe registration starts at 8 a.m. And uh, I'm gonna run around on the megaphone at 9 a.m. and let people know we're leaving by 10. That's the plan. Your neighbor's camp right beside us this morning. There's the man, the myth, the legend right there. Rolling in. Here's this guy again, just running around. <laughs> Got in the sun. Yeah, right beside me. Wristband. How's it going? Good. People said they couldn't hear it last year because the kettle was so loud. So Matt's about to give the safety race meeting, race safety meeting, and uh, then everyone's heading upstream together. It begins. Hey man, welcome to the kayak fest, everyone. We got big sporty levels this year, you guys all kind of see. Pretty unusual for August to have it sitting at four plus on the bridge gauge. If you're doing the advanced boat race, I would ask that if someone's swimming, that you help the swimmer. Right on. We are on our way to the races. I'm driving upstream to the put in of the river at uh, Kettle Falls, I believe. So it's all gonna start there. Let's get up there. Here we are on the porch, getting ready. Let's go get down there. Races are about to begin. <laughs> I didn't realize they're starting out here. <laughs> All chilling up top, like, where is everyone? No, What's your good. name? Oh, Timmy. Timmy. Yeah. Nico. Nico? Nice to meet you. Hey, good to meet you, man. Yeah. Good way to meet people. <laughs> Does everyone need a ride up? Yes. Figured it's like, I've got no car. Just hitched hike back up top. So Matt is hosting a lunch for all the festival goers, competitors and whatnot. So we're gonna go catch that lunch upstream and uh, go back and start setting up for music. That's the plan. Yes, sir. Going to lunch down the road. and lunch for everybody.
Oh yeah. Mm. <laughs> this is cool. Look at this raft launch right here. You pull rafts out or put in. That felt so good. I just scored myself a shower right there at Dutch Lake Beach Park. It's right here in uh, Clearwater. There's uh, free showers inside, but they are freezing cold. But you know what? I feel clean. So let's go head down to the festival. I'm gonna start getting uh, the music sound stuff set up and uh, just chill. Cause that way I don't wanna have a bunch of loose ones in case we don't get enough everyone the festival is ending today sunday so i'm gonna pack up my gear and get on out of here but it was an awesome weekend and uh it's all good to say thank you matt for putting this on dude it's pretty sweet if you guys did enjoy the video make sure to smash the like button down there and uh, subscribe to the channel and uh, we'll see you on the next one peace y'all